They have it down to a science. Evelyn Mount and her staff of volunteers are preparing hundreds of food baskets for families in need. It's a big task, and but we get it done. <laughs> it's a full-time job almost. <laughs> Serving those in Reno and Sparks since 1979 out of the garage of her home, Mount accepts food, clothing, and monetary donations from the community. We first started right at the neighborhood, right around where we were working, and then it just spread it out, and the word got out, and it's just been going bigger and bigger. That growth, along with the holiday season demand just around the corner and shelves running on low, the need for donations is greater than ever. We are asking people now to bring all kinds of vegetables, all kinds of meats or whatever they can bring to make a family dinner, that's what we need. Mount expects to have 9,000 requests for food for Thanksgiving and 10,000 for Christmas. And with a turnout like that, she's worried about being able to continue her mission from her home. She's hoping someone can donate a facility that will accommodate the community outreach. They're also looking for a box van to transport donated items. Like now, every time I rent one every week, it's $160 to rent a U-Haul from up there and gas. And it's really running, it's running hard on me. Volunteers say the donations are critical in making sure the program lives on. Community Outreach is a nonprofit organization, and so the lifeline is dependent upon the community for donations, uh, monetary and uh, uh, food-wise. So uh, anything that we can get uh, is a big help. And Mount doesn't plan on quitting her lifetime of laboring love anytime soon. I don't think that it will never end. Never end. As long as people are donating, as long as I got breath in my body, I'm going to do it. For more information on how you can help Evelyn Mount and her community outreach, go to foxreno.com. Reporting in Reno, Shannon Moore, Fox 11 News.